Hey everyone, Edward here at the Mac Observer and in this video I'll show you what to do if your AirTags are not connecting to your iPhone. So the solutions are super super simple and the first one that you should take in consideration is to restart your device. I know it sounds super simple, but problems like this can be solved by simply restarting your device. So the easiest way to do this is hold the lock button and the volume until the restart option or the shutdown option shows up and just shut down your phone and turn it on again. Then you can check if the problem still persists. Moving on, another useful solution is to change your AirTag's battery. Sometimes it can be depleted, so this can fix the issue in no time. If you want to check this one, tap on settings, then in the search bar type in find my, then select it from the search results, and afterwards in here check if your AirTag's battery is running low, because there will be an alert next to the indicator. The alert will say low battery, so just replace your battery and you're good to go. You can move on to the next solution if this is not the issue. Next in line, you can also update your iPhone to the latest iOS version. To do this, tap on the settings button, then head over to general and afterwards tap on software update. Now in here, just make sure to wait until the latest update shows up if you don't have automatic updates on and then just install it. You can then check if the problem still persists because this update can solve the issues with your AirTag. It can happen that the previous update has some problems with the AirTag itself. Moving on, another useful solution is to reset the location and privacy on your iPhone. Now to do this, tap on settings, then head over to general, and afterwards scroll down until you find the transfer or reset iPhone. So tap on this one, and then tap on reset. Now in here, the last thing you have to do is tap on reset location and privacy. Type in your passcode and you're good to go. The process will start and then you can check if the problem still persists. Next in line, you can also update your AirTag's firmware. Now to do so, press the settings app, once again tap on the search bar and select find my or search it in here. Now in here, tap on the items tab and select your AirTag and tap on your AirTag's name. In case this firmware is not the latest one, make sure to update it to avoid any issues. And then you're good to go. And lastly, you can also check location settings on your iPhone. To do so, tap the settings button, then head over to privacy and security, so tap on it. Afterwards, tap on location services and make sure that location services is turned on. From here on, you're good to go. You can check if the issue still persists and that's it. Super simple, isn't it? Of course, if this video helped you, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more quality content. Thanks for watching.